chill. Nah, he's gonna pray my other. I really wanted to claw him. He might not pray it here. Dead? I'm not gonna double claw it. Into the ball, please. Please. Whip. He's holding on. Damn it. Just keep whipping him. Keep whipping him. I'm not gonna freeze him. I'm just gonna keep whipping him. Zero. 29. Please. <laughs> Good fight. Holy shit. I thought he would have just died to the claw. He just drops a fucking frat smiley face as he dies. Welcome back to another video of our progress leading up to the Jax All-Stars. Last video was a pure one, so I thought I'd go back on the main, get accustomed to the prayers. We'll switch up between the pure main and Zerker while we lead up to the event, just so we get refreshed on all kinds of it, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. Oh, why do I misclick every time something like this happens, man? Claw him out. Please. Is that, is that something big? It drank crossbow fury double carols. Oh! Carols top. 600 volts. 500. Okay, okay, okay. Welcome to dinner man mode. Ho what the fuck, dude? What the hell? Armored old D-hide boots? <laughs> okay. And how much loot did we receive today? Just a quick little price check. Boots are a mil itself. That's another 1.6 mil. Alright, alright, alright. You know, go to get everything in there. Solid 3.56 mil. Owned. We got a bird battle. Let's click Mirages, classic Ditter Bitter. So you're not gonna change his prayers at all? He's just gonna count prayer range. Hopefully, the okay, actually change them. One more bolt. Claw him out. Terrible claw. Barrage, zero. Where's he running to? Oh, I just staff bashed him. I'm scared he's gonna try and adjust me. Dead? Good fight. He just trust the whole- Wait, did, you, did I just see prayer pots in that pile? Yeah, I did. He had one prayer pot. GG. He only had an ancient staff and he didn't have a tank shield. It's only 369k loot. Jeez, I didn't even know you could broaden the gel otherwise. Chill. I just mistyped everything. Catch a freeze. Put a bolt in. I should be able to claw him out. Should I just keep it as HP higher? Which is smart. Let's keep it at super high. Jeez. Going for a bolt. Change your prayers, please. He changed them? Claw him out? Good fight. Most people won't change their prayers. They're smacked? Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? What was that? Something on there looked like an AGS, or maybe I'm just going blind. It's like the rocks, man. GG. Either way, it was like 370 kilo. No tank shields. What's going on here? We've got a party. I think we're gonna get PJ'd if I get close to killing him, because they look like they're on the same team, but yeah. I just gotta keep barraging him, because he doesn't seem to be able to pre mage properly. He's about to die to barrages. No, he's not. I lied. Put on the bolts. Put on another bolt. Okay, now he's only pre mage. Let's go for another freeze. Bolt him. Claw him out. Dead. Good fight, man. He literally did like 20 damage in total. Good fight, man. GG, dude. Oh, this guy doesn't pee. How much loot was this? 490k. Nice. An extra mage defense to camp. Let's see if this guy fights me. Why does he just run? Let's 
Good luck. Am I in YouTube vid? I will. Why would he be in a YouTube vid? Am I fighting you? Vault zone. Another freeze. Another one. Dead? Oh, he played in melee. I can respect it. It's smart. It was a good play. Dead? How was he not dead? Oh, good fight. GG, man. He just drops a good fight. Good fight, man. I won't try this one. Okay, good fight, man. So this is this guy in the PvP, PvP world in Edgeville who I'd never seen before in full arms, toxic staff, and stuff like that. He was saying he's not that good. I thought maybe he was like noob baiting, or I'm not exactly sure what he was doing. Maybe he was just way too rich and was just fucking around. So he's basically in like arms, dragon crossbow, stuff like that, PKing. So I, I, I wanted to go for the fight, you know, I'm going to be doing fights like that anyway, I might as well get the practice in. And I wasn't sure if he was a noob or if he was pretending to be a noob, but we ended up doing a fight real quick. So in the middle of the fight, you could say I've already used one of my specs, so I was just trying to get a good opportunity to use another spec. You could see we're both kind of sitting, I'm sitting at least a little bit lower HP than no, most people would be at like max fights, because I was trying to make him risk HP a little bit. And I guess it worked, as you can see here, I go for the AGS, he's on maybe 50 HP and I hit his 0 AGS off prayer, I could have killed him so easily there, it was super unlucky. And then I go in for a 37 barrage into a 55 AGS whack, but he just manages to hold on. And eventually, he, look at that. He glory teleports. He goes back to Edgeville. He teleports like a couple a couple steps southwest of me, and I don't even realize that I tab out. So I could have potentially whacked him again and killed him. All right, I got another fight with this guy. We literally almost, we've hit him like a 0 on 50 HP, and then we barraged him an 11 on like 20 HP. And then he didn't have a telly. So he literally gloried to, uh... Edge as I tell it out. I don't know if you guys caught that in the clip, but yeah, we have to kill this dude. I'm gonna have to risk low HP because otherwise he won't risk low HP. That's why I've got the fire cape out as well. It makes me look a little bit more newbie, but in all honesty, just gives me an extra max hit on the GMO and the AGS. I don't know if I'm gonna use the GMO yet. Rather have more KO opportunity. Pray melee there. He could obviously kill me with the claws as well, which I got to be careful for. Because that, that shit can hit like 76s or 78s and the right strength bonus, which I think he has, to be honest. So let's just pray melee here. He's going for another freeze. He's going for the HS. Oh, he ate. Um, okay, let's just pray melee there because he's probably going to claw spec us. Oh, fuck. We're getting destroyed. We're getting destroyed. He's, got, he's popping off specs like it's no man's business. Pray melee there. Okay, it was a fakie by the looks of it. It's going for a bolt. Nice. Ah, fuck, we're frozen. I need that. It's all part of the plan. He went up to full HP real quick, didn't he? He's going for another freeze. Nice. Dead, please? Dead? Good fight. 41 for the KO. We finally got him. GG, my bro. He should have died last fight to the 50 EGS, to be honest, but we finally got him. That's some big... That's like a max kill right there. You killed my friend? I'm sorry. Walrus well, just tried to TBA me. Let's pick that all up. That's some very nice loot. Okay, I think we got all of it. My friends are just fucking with me. They like, threw a TB at me. I honestly start panicking a little bit. Either way, let's get a price check on all of that. Uh, that is a 35.6 mil PK. GG. Alright guys, as we seem to do with all our big kills, we seem to do a little giveaway. So today I've decided to give away the Toxic Staff and the Dragon Crossbow to one lucky winner. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed if you aren't, and comment down below who do you guys think the underdog going into the All-Stars 20 is, who's going to surprise everyone, and I'll pick a winner and announce it in the next video. There he is. Good luck, brother. I said god luck. Good luck. Clench your anus. Clenched. This should be an interesting one. Okay, he starts off with a blist. Does he, is he not 94 mage? What? Maybe he was brewed out or something. Okay, he's got a ballista. Truly behemoth 90, 94 mage, right? Why is he blitzing me? Okay. Okay, okay, now he's barraging me. Interesting. He's got, he's got an Ava switch for the Ballista. Interesting. Seems we're just camping pre mage, so I'll just keep barraging him. He's going for the Staff Bash. 
Interesting play. Claw him out. Double claw it. Into the bulk KO. 40. Easy. You're not even dead. Oh shit, per range. That might have been all. Oh my god. If he claws me now, I'm dead. I'm actually kind of scared. Okay, there's the DDS again. Whoop K on the ropes? Dad could fight. Rip, he drops. GG, he had a fedora, man. GG. Close one, yeah, that's pretty close. Could have gone either way. GG, how much should we get off Mr. Behemoth? A solid 209. Alright, this is just me picking the giveaway winner from the pure video where I did a giveaway there as well. 1,243 entries. And let's see who the random winner is. Goes through all the entries and just picks someone randomly. And Jude Hamer is the winner, saying that Torvesta will be winning the All-Stars if I don't win. So I'm going to respond to your comment, ask for your RSN, and we can set up giving you the uh, giveaway stuff. Thanks for entering, and yeah. Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video. Let me know in the comments if the next video you guys want to see, you want to see on a main, a Zerker, or a Pure. Other than that, leave a like if you did. Uh, don't if you didn't. Subscribe if you are new, and I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for watching.